Hi everybody, how's it going? Welcome back to Jurassic Park, the game. We are heading down to confront Dr. Sorkin, who it turns out might be a bad yeah, guy after all. My ears. Attention, What's yes. going on? The Lagoon Rotunda and Spectacular is housed in a pressurized underwater environment. We suggest you pinch your nose and push your breath to equalize your ears while we descend. Huh. If you experience any lasting discomfort or feel unusually giddy, let your attendant know immediately. Giddy? They're talking about nitrogen narcosis. It's a risk of breathing pressurized air. What makes you the expert? I, uh, saw it in a movie. Guess we're going pretty deep. Whoa! Is that where we're going? Whoa, check out that place. I think so. Whoa! Whoa, this is pretty awesome. This looks like a viewing station for something that could potentially want to eat us, though. Which makes me a little bit uncomfortable. I wasn't expecting any of this. This is so cool. But where did Sorkin go? That's the question. Careful, I'll lead. Hopefully there's no dinosaurs down here. Cool. Look at that. Uh speak with Hammond. We can hear her. This can't wait. Can you connect me to Mr. McGuire? Or no, Peter Ludlow. Please hurry. Wonder where she is. No, look. This is Dr. Laura oh, I have a bad I feeling about this. Park. Oh, she's in there. On the premises. Get me somebody. This isn't going to go well, is it? How are we going to get down into there? Something tells me that thing's going to visit us though. Was it a Mosasaur, did they say? I do not need rescuing. I do not want the bombing waylaid. I want it stopped. Hello, what? let us in. It's not contaminated. This is a wildlife preserve. Can we open this up? Bet it's locked. These animals are not diseased. It's locked from the inside. They're extremely endangered. It's gotta be an override somewhere, right? You're Surely. Not listening to me. What? Oh, okay, that's. I was gonna say, what's that scratch on the floor? But it's not. It's just the mosasaur, I guess. Is it a mosasaur? Did do? Has that been confirmed? I don't think it has. Has it? I think they said it looks like a mosasaur, but it might not be. Hello. Uh oh. She doesn't seem happy to see us. I wonder why. Oh. Can we do something with this? When in doubt, press all the buttons on the panels, right? Hey, Dad! This looks like an intercom up here. What? Where? Good find, honey. Can we talk to Sorkin Laura, on that? It's me, Jerry. Yeah. Laura? Jerry, I hear you. And I'm glad you're here. This is gonna be a lot easier now. What is? What have you been doing? We're gonna stop the bombing, Jerry. This island must be preserved. I, I kind of see where she's coming from. <clears throat> no, don't lock us in. What are you doing? I have taken the remaining survivors hostage. Oh, God. There are four others. Three Americans and one Costa Rican. I won't let them go unless the plans to bomb the island are completely rescinded. Not the way to go about it, Doc. Uh, let's go. How dare you leverage us as pawns? We want off the island. Help us or let us go. Five people are better than one. Protesting is a game of measurable attrition. Protest? My god, this isn't a political maneuver. You're putting us in danger to serve your own agenda. We deserve a chance to survive. Think about Jess, Laura. This isn't something you want on your conscience. Definitely not. I'm sorry, Jerry. I need you here. Uh, what will happen? Billy. Will InGen stop the bombing? Doubt it. InGen is not the one dropping bombs, it's the US military. And the contingency is based around a biohazard cover story. Right. She may just be delaying the inevitable. Brilliant. If you don't offer me some sort of guarantee that the island will be preserved, I will have to escalate matters. I mean, I kind of feel like the island should be preserved, but this is this not the is way to go about it. Fine, put the military on the phone. Hello? Hello? You want to see contamination of the global ecosystem? We don't want to contaminate anything um other options Laura there are other options here 
Holding us against our will to save the dinosaurs is only one poorly thought out solution. You're smarter than that, Laura. I know, Jerry. I know what I'm doing. I clearly expressed the consequences of threatening this island. I scored a line in the sand that has been ignored and trampled over by InGen, by the government, and now I exercise my resolve. You're Laura. doing it the wrong way. I'm going to free the Mosasaur. No, Are don't do that. A land dinosaur paddling to the mainland is one thing, but you're talking about releasing an apex predator into over 70% of the global ecosystem. Yeah, that's a it's very a bad idea. It can be recaptured. No, it can't. It eats the last of the humpbacks? Oh, don't be dramatic. Laura, don't. Oh, no. She's done it. Has she done it? This, yeah, this is a dreadful idea, Doc. Um, how are you going to recapture it? Plan B. What, what are we going to do with an axe? Seriously, what, how is that going to help this situation? Apparently it is, though, so... What are we going to do? Cut through the obviously really thick glass? <clears throat> Chop through the locked door? Like... I don't think that's going to work, dude. Seems like a reinforced door. I mean, it might, but... I would have thought they would make it reinforced in case there was, like, a, a breach in the thing. Apparently not. <laughs> Apparently I'm wrong. Sorry, Jerry. For the sake of this island and the scientific treasure it holds, I have been forced to take an action. It's not too late. We can reverse this. No. I locked the system down. Oh, good. It's out. I've opened the gates and the Mosasaur is free to leave. Laura, you have to- No, Jerry, this isn't up for debate. We have to show- Looks like it's coming out. this way. Fantastic. Oh, damn, she's in the water. Go for the ladder! I think that might be the end of Sorkin. <laughs> I think that might be the end of Sorkin. What were you thinking? Everybody, be cool. And stay away from the window. Be cool? That's right. What? You want an I told you so? I don't know about you, but I came here to make a phone call. I, I don't know why you think they're going to talk to you, dude. This Hello. is a bit of a situation. This is William Yoder, ID 4122. Put me through to Haskell. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. The U.S. Embassy. Or at least he follows. seems to be able to talk to someone. The island is completely overrun. Alpha team killed in action. Save one. Myself. Bravo team killed in action. Two helicopters disabled. Two civilian casualties. I have access to a seaworthy boat and I will evacuate the remaining survivors. Yes, sir. The military may proceed. 90 minutes. Understood, sir. Oh, good. The military are going to proceed. Apparently we don't get a choice here. I guess these were the days before you got choices in Telltale games. What was that about? I guess he's going to tell them. What's happened? Who did you call? So yeah, we got 90 minutes or we're going to die, guys. Um... That's far enough. What? What? You're not coming with me. What? There's going to be a tragic accident, Jerry. No, there's not. Nima, we have everything we need. We're finishing this without them. What? No, 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 we're not. No tragic accidents today. No. Ha <laughs> What do you mean, no? We've got an agreement, remember? An agreement doesn't involve killing Jerry and Jess. Exactly. What's going on? I'm sorry, Jerry. I was sent here to retrieve dinosaur embryos from InGen. I I don't understand. You're you're a corporate spy? The truth all comes out. Yes. Damn it, Nima. I trusted you. It's not like that. Yoder took the can. He wants it for himself. And I'm trying to help you and Jess. What can? A can, can of embryos. Cream. It has a compartment to smuggle the embryos off the island. Damn it, Nima. You're blowing it. No, you are. Oscar put his faith in you. He may have been a devil, but he wore his sins on his arm for everyone to see. 
You, you are just a mask with nothing behind it. Oh, it's pretty true though. You can't do this. Don't you care? Don't you care about Oscar or Decap? That's enough. Everyone, stay back. I'm gonna give you a sporting chance here. Bill, oh no. No, 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 don't, don't do, do that, buddy. Run! Okay. Did you lose the embryos? Please don't have ruptured. Oh, no. Come on, get up. Okay, well, we're in trouble. We're in big trouble. Why did we drop down to silver there? There was nothing that happened. Run! Close the door, close the door. Close the damn door. We closed the door. Why did we get silver on that? I didn't miss anything. That, that was weird. Right, well, we're sealed inside the central area, at least, which is probably a good thing. Lots of little fish out there as well. Is anybody hurt? Is everyone all right? Looks Maybe, like it. Besides being trapped in this bubble by that desgraciado, we're as good as dead. Well, Don't say that. Yeah. Somebody might, somebody will come for us. Yeah, I doubt that yeah. very much. Yoder left us here. He'll take the boat and not tell anyone about us. Maybe he won't take the boat. He has the canister. He knows where the boat is. He, uh... Oh, she took the canister. the canister. I'm sorry. I promise not to steal anymore. Okay, but... that one's a freebie. Jerry, <laughs> look! Oh, great. Just great. Why is it flooding? Must be the damage to the door. We're losing air pressure. This place will flood right up to the highest hole in the Oh, room. no, really? <laughs> Even if we could open the door against the pressure, the whole rotunda is flooded. There's nowhere to go. Wait a second. I remember. Maybe there still is a way out. If we swim. Uh, swim? I don't, I don't well, want to do that. feet with that Mosasaur swimming around. Maybe. Look at that pipeline. It leads out of this lagoon. There are caves at the far end. Those caves connect to others that lead back to the beaches. Because right. the pipeline is covered. And you think we can hold our breath the whole way? Dad, look. There's diving here. No, 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 no. Oh, no. nice. We don't know the first thing about scuba diving. I do. What? We have to distract the Mosasaur. Figure something out and meet us back down here. Mosasaur? That was a weird subtitle. Scuba diving? Looks like we've got no choice, to be honest, or we're going to drown in here, so <laughs> may as well give it a go. Oh, come on. How could this be so complicated? I don't know thing one about diving. Dad, don't mess with the mixture valve. They're all preset. Since when do you know about diving? Remember those lessons you wouldn't let me take? Did your mother override my decision? Um, actually, Steve bought me lessons. It was a secret. Mom's boyfriend? Yeah. If it's any constellation, I got grounded and Steve slept on the couch for a week. <laughs> nice. It's probably just as well that, that he did, to be quite honest. Otherwise, we'd all be uh, drowning right about now. I wonder how long it'll take for this room to flood. I'm gonna guess Let's not, find out, Dad. not long. I'm gonna guess not long. We need the wetsuits. The water should be warm. You need this the wetsuits. And this time of the day, be freezing. we would totally go hyperthermic. Yep. Don't worry, Dad. Neoprene makes everyone look good. <laughs> it's not my modesty I'm worried about. It's better than being just flesh out there, trust me. Uh, right, let's switch then and I'll use this view. be right back. Is there anything we can do from up here? <gasps> Maybe we can use the feeder to distract the Mosasaur. If we release a load of food, perhaps it will get distracted by it all. Right. Factory B, pool four. That looks like the one scheduled for today's feeding. B four. Okay. That ought to keep it busy. That's what I'm thinking. Don't fancy our chances against that thing, though, I'll be honest. Oh, okay, looks like we're going in. 
Going for a dip. Okay, what do we do? Dad, I changed my mind. These are rebreathers and I've never actually used one. I'm not ready for this. Hey, you can do no. this. No, what if something goes wrong? I don't want to do this. I don't want anyone Better else. Better than drowning in here though. Uh, I love you. Jess, I, I know I don't say this enough, but I love you. Maybe I seem so overbearing, but it's because Sarah got away from me. And I don't want the same thing to happen with us. But right now, all that matters is that we get through this. Everything else, we can work that out later. It's small stuff compared to this. I just... I just don't want you to go away. I'm so tired of you always going away. I know, honey, but I'm here right now. And I'm not going to leave you alone. I'll be here with you all the way. Now, what's the diver signal for okay? It's universal, duh. <laughs> right, right. Well, I promise to signal you whenever you check on me, okay? Scared. Is he gonna die? I, I, I get the feeling that he's gonna die. Let's just admit it. I am too, but I know we'll make it with your help. Okay, Jess, you ready? Yeah, let's do this. So, how do these things work? Well, these are closed circuit rebreathers. They look custom designed. Okay. So let's take a look, I guess. The tank is small, maybe 15 minutes of air. Should be enough? enough. But it recycles the air you exhale. It should work for about 45 minutes. Try not to freak out. You'll use air faster. You might even mess up the CO2 scrubbers. That sounds bad. Yep. CO2 poisoning is totally Very bad. bad. This is the regulator. It's built into the mask. It wants to help you breathe. Don't fight it. And don't hold your breath. Okay, don't hold my breath. Definitely not. That's it. The suit's mostly automated. It'll keep you, like, buoyant and manage your oxygen. Oh, and try to swim casual. Swim casual? Don't spaz yeah. off. It attracts No, sharks. um, flapping around. Mosasaurs? Probably the same. Probably them too. Turn around. Slow, calm swimming, dude. That's the way to go. Fun fact, I am actually a qualified scuba diver. Might not have expected that, but it's true. In real life, I'm talking about. Looks like we're going for a swim, guys. Alright then, and that is where we're going to leave it for this episode. Ooh, it's getting very tense now, isn't it? I bet that thing's going to clock that we're in there, and then there's going to be a quick time event and all sorts, but we'll do that in the next episode. So as always, thank you very much for watching. A big thank you to my patrons, Arcades Games, Wayne, Nate, Terminally Nerdy, Paul from the Phantom Fellows, and Lyle for all the support. I really do appreciate it. If you enjoyed the video, hit that like button. Make sure you subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you all next time.